Alright, this is Neon White. I'm pretty sure this music isn't soundtrack by Twitch, so I shouldn't get DMCA'd. But it's worth it. Alright, if I get DMCA'd, I'm I'm completely fine with that because the music in this game, it bangs, it slaps, it, whatever whatever adjective you have to call music good, this is all of this. But just to introduce you into what this game is, I'm gonna do the first level. This in this tutorial level, you're basically just you're just moving fast. You have to get to the end of the level as fast as possible. Click a platformer, but there's also a mechanic uh, that I will show you. Cards. So let me just do this one fast. I was slow. Ah, oh, no, I messed. <laughs> I messed up. So each um, gun in this game, because it's like an FPS, is represented by a card, and you can either shoot the gun and just kill enemies that way, or you can um, discard them, and then it'll make an explosion. So, well, it'll, all of them have different abilities. The Purify, the purple card, has an explosion, so I would do this to kill all the enemies, and then I can use those like little platformers, which is what makes this game really cool. I'm gonna go to a level that I was bullied into speedrunning, kind of. So, <laughs> one of my friends said, oh, you're not in the top 100 so, for the speedrun, so it doesn't even matter. So, I'm gonna try to get to the top 100 for this level. This is one of my favorite levels in the game. It's, okay, I'm 152 right now. I was 120-something uh, more. Also, people cheat, like, a lot in this game. So, because if you go to the, to the, um, leaderboards, like, it's zero seconds, one second, three seconds, like, uh, that's impossible. Twelve seconds, I think, I think there's a, the world record is slower than twelve seconds, but I'm just gonna do this level. So you can go through it just like, kind of, like this, go through the level normally, well, somewhat normally, but, or, you could take the alternate route. So, jump through here, go up, go up here. Grab these two. <laughs> you don't die. You don't die. That's that's a major part of it. You don't. You're not supposed to die. So you jump up here. You grab both of these cards, and then you use that card to get up top, and you can just get to that purple crystal without having to do all the levels to get to it. Um, I'm gonna do some runs of this, but it's not gonna be the only level I play. Just to try to get that top 100, I only have to be like half a second faster too, because if I go, yeah, my time is 20.58, and the 100, oh, 99 is, 100 is 24.48, so I don't even have to be half a second faster. It doesn't sound like a lot, but once I like got into speedrun this game, I realized literally every millisecond counts. See, like, I just... I think I bumped my head, so I was too slow there. Like, jumping, for instance. I'm jumping is a lot fast, a lot slower than walking, but it gets you farther, so sometimes you want to jump, and sometimes you don't. I guess, no, when you're going up, like, walk, running here is, is slower, but normally running is faster than jumping. But there's also running on water makes you faster. There's a lot of uh, mechanics at this point. I'll just try to explain them as I get to them. For now, I'm just gonna try to finish the story. I recommend you buy it for yourself. Because this is a very good game. It's worth it. It was just on sale. I don't think it's on sale anymore, but Steam always has sale. Alright. I don't even know what this level is. Um, okay. Yeah, I haven't even done this level. Uh, yeah, this is the rocket launcher, so the rocket launcher also acts like a grappling hook. So, you can grapple, and I can use it as a rocket launcher. Oh shit, ah, that's... Yeah, whenever I'm first going through a level, especially these later levels, they get really complicated. But I have some times in this game that I'm pretty proud of. For being a... Someone who doesn't, like, speedrun game. Like, I've never... The only game I've tried to speedrun that I think is like, Super Meat Boy, and it did not go well. Uh, I should have gotten the extra ammo. Okay. 
that one was a sniper, it makes you just zoom fast in one direction. The characters in the game are all called Neons, and um, each Neon has their own card. Mine is just a sword, but um, like each, there's Neon Violet, there's Neon Yellow, Neon, um, neon Red, you know, there's a bunch of Neons. We haven't met Neon Teal, or whatever Neon has his rocket launcher card. I think they died, I'm pretty sure, so we might not meet them. But yeah, every character has their own card. And you can only play as one character, but like you know, just interacting with every character they have. They have little quirks, their tropes. They're all fun. And the voice acting is really good. I don't know why, but it reminds me of Persona or something. Literally every game reminds me of Persona, so that could be why. So usually I just try to beat the level and then I'll go through it as fast as I can. And then after I complete the whole um the whole stage, I'll go back and I'll get the secret presents, and when you give those to people, that's how you unlock side quests and extra, um, and extra dialogue. So, the main story is, you died, and you were a very bad person, so you, were, you got sent to hell. But every year there's a competition where um, damn souls can get a chance to go into heaven, and they have to basically kill um, a bunch of demons, and whoever kills the most demons and gets the most points wins. Who well, gets the highest neon rank wins? So neon rank is just determined on, well, it's determined on how many demons you kill. And the higher, um, the higher rank you get on the level, meaning the faster you do it, the higher um, you know, your neon, the more your neon rank goes. Okay, neon violet, neon red, neon yellow, and neon green. So they worked with you, like they were, you were all part of like, a big criminal group. And neon green is basically the boss but he's like you're you all working together you're basically partners but he just runs and you won't be seeing much of uh, neon yellow because he's dead yeah he's, he's super dead like extremely dead long story how my first how? try too how did i get ace on my first try i i, I felt like i was going so slow but um Alright, cool, cool. Every level has like a hint to make you go faster. And sometimes I just accidentally do them. But I guess this time I was just really good. When I was playing through the demo, it took me like days. Um, but it took me, yeah, it took me at least like a couple weeks just to get through the whole demo. I was gonna say, it didn't, you know, it didn't take me days to get through single, le single levels. But it took me a long, very long time to Actually, I think this is a level from the demo as well. That, my favorite one from the demo I haven't seen yet. So I'm assuming they didn't take that one out. By the way, I still didn't get to my favorite level on stream, so if you want to see me play that, subscribe to the channel or follow me on Twitch. Or both, even better. And since we're plugging, I kind of did just put out a whole album. You know, no big deal. It's a Friday Night Funkin' Remix album. It has 15 songs, all of them slap and bang. They're not as good as the Neon White soundtrack, but they're amazing, so go check it out. Link in the description, and yeah, I will stop plugging now. <laughs> they did say, um, <coughs> that it wasn't final, and that anything was subject, er, anything was subject to change, but it wasn't really. <coughs> anyway, hold on. Some water. Hmm, hydrated, hydrated. Anyways, uh, I would assume they didn't take out the level because it was a really high quality. There weren't really any major issues with it. It was just very difficult. I guess, yeah, yeah, I could say, I would say that that level took me days to complete. But I was also speedrunning other levels in between just because it was that difficult. Also, this one was really difficult for me when I first did it. I just beat the whole demo 100% of it, got all the gifts, did all the levels, aced all of them. And I'm gonna try to 100% the game too, get all the dialogue, all the aces. Well, there's different ranks. Silver means you completed it, like you actually completed the level. Um, gold means that you completed it pretty well, like, and then ace means that you completed it really well. And all three of them have corresponding times. So, um, I'm gonna try to ace every level. And red aces, I think you get for getting specific Didn't times. Didn't even break a sweat. <clears throat> Most of the time you'll get gold if you're just going through it pretty fast, on your first try at least. 
Yeah, when I get to the level that I really like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you. Oh, it's that one. I'm gonna be playing that one a bunch. Cause it's so hard and it's a long level, dude. So hard? Pause. <laughs> we <coughs> resume. Resume Twitch demon for you. Mm. You know what? Not even resume. Fast forward. But weirdly enough, there were a lot of scams like around this game when it first came out. Like I was here <coughs> about people in the Discord server getting like getting some scams about the game. I actually got sent one was like, oh, I false reported your account. I need to report it here to the admin of Twitch, and they, they gave me apparently, sorry, no, they, apparently the admin of Steam's Discord, so I could reach out to him personally about this. I'm like, how stupid do you think I am? Why would the admin of Steam, one of the biggest, well, one of the biggest video game uh, retailers in the country, in the world, be just have his Discord open and like take people's requests and, like help people out with tech support on discord there's some wretched people on discord i will say that dream stands the way and opinion is inbound and a hot take at that not to not to hate even more on the dream smp but i was in tommy in server for um a little a good while and um i do not want to go back i would not go back Wilbur's server is better, but still, it's same audience, same kind of, same kind of thing. Similar audience. And I didn't even need the ace. Done. I didn't even need the head. Mm-hmm, absolutely, absolutely. Wizard, thank you for the follow. Once you go black, you never go back, absolutely. Meaning that you are not allowed to unfollow once you follow me. Mm, see, you're not gonna, you're not gonna call me toxic. I'm only toxic when I want to be toxic. One more follower, and FNAF Sister Location VR is coming up. This is my face. This is literally me. What are you talking about? This is what I look like in real life. What? 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 I don't get... This. Okay. There's a lot of confined spaces, and I don't know what I'm doing. See, that's how funny I am. I can't even get my own jokes out. I don't even think you deserve to hear my jokes, you know. I'm too much for you. That was the wrong decision. So at this point I started beefing with this guy in chat named Twitch Demon420 and uh it got kinda out of hand. It was really funny, but I'm probably gonna cut most of it out. So See, you're a Twitch demon, I'm a Twitch gremlin. Even worse. That's the thing, there's so many different ways to complete these levels that I end up thinking that every way that I'm doing it is the wrong way. And most of the time I'm right. See, if I ace this, I'm gonna be extremely surprised. I doubt it. I highly doubt it. If I ace this, then the game is broken. Like, 100% the game is broken. Uh, oh! <laughs> no, wait! See, I said the stream was going to be special. Maybe it's going to be special because it's the one where we reach the goal and I'm forced to play a scary game. Just, it's one of those levels. Also, those bubbles act as shields. Whoa, 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 whoa. See, I don't tolerate that. Yeah, extremely family, family friendly. Absolutely. They don't like that at all. You know what else I don't tolerate? Being bad at games. Because I'm never bad. See, I'm literally killing your kind. You're a Twitch demon, I'm destroying demons. See, you might I might have to get into gamer mode. I might have to I might have to show you guys guys my ult my ult um I might have to show my my demon time persona. Because I love playing VR games. I've been getting back into VR games. Like, I'll just go through like playing VR every day for like a couple weeks and then I won't play anymore and then nerds like nerds like twitch demon for 20 <laughs> nerds and of course nerds like twitch demon 420 they don't play VR they just hit up the metaverse and all good. buy up a couple monkeys I mean, sorry buy up a couple apes get some get some some pick some punks they're all good 
They don't need to play FPI because they're living the metaverse. I mean, like, if you're praying to like a long, a long-haired guy, like who's mostly a pair of shirtless, I'm sorry, but I'm sorry, but you, you've already, you've already made your spot in hell. By praying to Jesus, you've already earned your spot in hell. That's just two days. I can confirm. <clears throat> Speaking of hell, I'm definitely not making it out because I can't kill this demon. See, once you see these skills, once you see the skills, I will be officially able to pull you a nerd. Alright, this level... It wasn't too hard. I don't think it was. I don't know, I didn't ace it though, so... I guess it was. I don't know, I, I don't know, I moved on, so... Got the got the horned halo on my, my shirt. on my hoodie. Well, hoodie I mean. Ugh. So bad. I mean, I'm not bad. I'm a gamer. Actually. No nerds here. Oh, I'm I missed. Oh god, no! <laughs> ah. <laughs> Thank you, Quandell Pringle Game Up. <laughs> Quandell Pringle Game Up. <laughs> appreciated. And that is 15 people for FNAF sister location. But I appreciate it, and you have now forced me to play a scary game. And I simultaneously appreciate it and also kind of hate it, but yeah. Another game that I've been playing recently a lot is Risk of Rain. It's like a roguelite, uh, no sorry, roguelite, um, uh, I don't know, it's hard to explain. But it's very fun and very hard and you should try it. Yeah, difficult roguelites, that's kind of my thing I'm getting into. I might actually play Risk of Rain now. After this, uh, we have see. So I have Risk of Rain. I can play. Um, play Enter the Gungeon might be good, but I don't know about that. I should know really. I have. I I got some games recently. I have um a Peggle Rogue like. It's pretty fun. The Forest. Kind of not good at that though. So maybe not. See, yeah, I'm gonna turn off the stream and then immediately ace. Excuse me. And then immediately ace all these levels. That's just how it goes. I'm so much better off stream, I promise. That that's not for Twitch, alright. That's a that's a different kind of demon time. Looks like a tough look. Um I don't know I don't know who Jax is. I'm not Um Yeah, I'm I'm not I don't know who that is. I don't know. Uh <coughs> Yeah, um, but yeah, so this is a very extremely tough level. Uh, what was I saying? Damn, I can't remember now. Um, damn, I can't remember what I was gonna say. Uh, no, let's just, let's just put this one in. Yes, I've been dealt a very bad hand in this game. Alright, yeah, let's... Let's get some dialogue in, maybe some side quests. I don't know. Let's see. Um, I'm gonna introduce you to some new characters. Cool. I'm glad to see you're opening up, White. Great timing too. I just finished baking this for you. Oh, Peridot Crystal. Steven Universe. Uh, I don't know what to say. Thanks, Raz. Red's gonna be uh, Hold on, your tie's a little messed up. Let me fix it. There. If you keep looking at me like that, I'll shoot you. Damn. Damn. Alright, relax. Relax, Red. See, Red, she's, she's, um... I, I just have a feeling she's gonna get a certain crowd of artists interested in this game. And I don't have a lack of a female voice actress. So, does this smell like burning rubber to you? Oh. Oh, 
I think that's I think that's just my hair. Violet must have singed it trying to blow me up earlier. You know how she gets. Uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> yeah, Violet's kind of a psychopath. Yeah. Why don't you seem the, the least bit bothered when Violet pulls this crap? Why? Why would I be? I love Violet. Tell me something, Red. Would you call attempted murder an act of love? What exactly are you implying? I'm not implying anything. I'm telling you that Violet is literally trying to kill you. Which is very true. She also um kind of sabotaged us earlier in the game. This is actually gonna be good for you guys. I can teach you about fireball. So this is a shotgun, basically, but also it's a fireball, as you can obviously tell by name fireball. Okay, it's not like I'm basically on fire so I can go through wood panels for a bit of a time. Uh, I actually don't know, maybe. I, they could be. They could be. I don't know. Everybody post a picture of yourself in chat. See, now, if I play Ralphie the Plug on Twitch, that's how I get, that's how you get banned. I could play Ralphie the Plug on YouTube, probably. And just get copyrighted, and I wouldn't be able to have ads in the video and stuff. It's fine, because I don't have ads on normally. But if I play Ralphie the Plug on stream, I have a feeling that we're not going but this is uh, Neon Red's um, her level theme. So each character has a level theme song and just a regular theme song as well. There we go. Forty-three. Yeah, there's no, there's no, um, there's no um, ace ranks or anything on here for this one. Dang on. Also, she has a lot of spikes in her levels. Like, a lot of spikes, as you can see. She loves pain and torture, but I probably shouldn't have jumped there. <laughs> okay. Alright, nice, 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 nice. Oh, I have to go up this wall, I think. This is the, this is the best part. I just love drum and bass, especially with, like, games where you have to speed run them. It's just the perfect song for go fast. <laughs> okay. What? What? Oh, I can throw this. Actually, why? Ah, I kind of hate this game. So much. All right. Let okay. me actually try a bit harder. Okay. That that was not fair. That was not fair. I promise I'm good at this game. All right. Believe believe you me, I am good at this game. Also, uh, Ocean of Lean right there. Pretty nice. Pretty dank, if you will. Yeah. I don't act actually have to um, kill all the demons. I can just kind of avoid some of them. I'm just killing them because I can't. <laughs> Demon killer, that's me. I can just jump that, actually. Uh, <laughs> Where do I go? Oh. Oh. Uh. <laughs> oh, I could've just... Alright, I didn't even need to do that. Alright. Kinda sucks. So for his, I can't discard anything. I have to just shoot the card. So that makes things a lot harder, but... It's fun. It's fun. Actually, actually, it is fun. Ugh. Get over here. Well, it makes you run faster, like I said. These balloon guys, I like them. Easy to kill. Fun to bounce on. And... Bam! And... 
Go ahead. Short and sweet. Nice and simple. Also, this song slaps pretty hard. Now I'm gonna. Now I'm in a better, better state of mind. I can actually probably beat this level. I'm gonna talk more about the Risk of Rain DLC because it is wild. So apparently, there's a there's a new boss in the game. I've I've seen it. I haven't gotten to it yet, but it's unbeatable. I think it's part of the new game mode. But apparently, it's impossible to beat, which I wouldn't be surprised because there's other bosses that are extremely hard in this game none of them are I, to my knowledge are unbeatable but all of them are very difficult because i know there's one boss that was supposedly unbeatable but me and my friend beat him <laughs> so most of the time just extremely difficult i doubt they make an impossible boss in this game but then again uh this is the t risk of rain is the type of game to do that like you could be stacked with a million items and still lose to one random enemy that blew you up and that's just how the game is it's unfair but also you could go out like filza and die to a baby zone at least one minecraft reference per stream that's my new goal i also started playing minecraft more with a bunch of mods so i've been thinking about making videos on minecraft again just on java I just keep getting better and better but yeah let me know Oh, I already aced this level. Uh, the glass is kind of annoying. <laughs> it, okay, very annoying. <laughs> anyway, just to speak more on the neon white characters. So white, he can't remember. He doesn't have his memories. Uh, Violet, she's a uh, psychopath. She's pretty young as well. She's like... Uh, well, when she died, I think she's like 18. I'm pretty sure. And also apparently had a very troubled youth. And that's why she's... Uh, literally a psychopath and she got into the she got into the um just into crime a lot younger than everyone else in the group so that's also partially why she's a psychopath very interesting character i like her a lot more than when i started the game uh neon red i'm pretty sure me and well white and red were in a relationship before they died and she's kind of just teases red about that a lot Neon Yellow, uh, I don't really know his deal because according to Violet, he was just putting on an act of being a himbo and he sold, like, he sold, he made a bet on our lives and lost and that's how we died. But, um, yeah, so he might not actually be a himbo, but he plays just like, this. bro, dude, like, he's like Ryuji from Persona 5, if you know Persona 5. You should build yourself a five. He's, he's fun. Also the best friend of Neon White. And Neon Green, our boss, he, apparently we had some bad blood. So there's actually a cutscene that comes later in the game that I watched off screen where Neon White is talking to Neon Green. It's a flashback, by the way. They're about to go on this big heist that's very dangerous and that also kind of gets all of us killed. Basically, Neon White's trying to convince Green to not have us go, and eventually Green talks us out of it. So that might be part of why Green doesn't like us. But when you win this tournament, you get a kind of a corrupted halo that lets you stay in heaven. Which basically, it kind of makes you evil a little bit, but it's basically corrupted the soul and turned him against all of us. But overall, it's a very good game. I keep saying this, but 100% recommend it to anyone, anywhere, in any place, at any time. Except for me, because I literally cannot seem to play the game correctly. Not at all. Uh, yeah, corrupted Halo heat. Uh, what do you mean? Like, yeah, he has a Halo kind of like changes him almost. Like, I don't really know. We in the flashbacks, you don't really get much of what he was like neon green i mean but he um apparently he wasn't he was, like i said he was just friendly with us so i don't know why the halo would corrupt him like that unless like the angels have something out against him but like 
Yeah, that's. Um, I'm, I'm gonna move on. Okay. Uh, I I cannot get this level. Just can't. I'm, Sure you guys don't want to move to risk of rain, like do something else. I mean I'm not seeing any questions in the chat for it, so I guess not. So any roguelikes to suggest I will definitely play them. I'm I'm not looking for new games right now, but I am adding stuff to my wish list that I'm planning on playing. Obviously, we have System Location VR. Um, I'm gonna play Risk of Rain again at some point. Probably some more VR titles out there I could get into. Uh, hmm. I don't know, maybe some Switch games? Any just good indie games in general, I'd be definitely down to play. Alright, hold on, I'll be right back. How did I know about the Halo? What? It's gotta be a coincidence. There's no way that. But I mean, like, just the way the messages are phrased, the name seems so familiar. M Night Chaser. Why can't I? Why can't I place that? Maybe I'm just paranoid. I don't know, what do you think? Yeah, I'm sticking to it, but it's not working as you said it would, so... I don't know, what if this M. Night Shade person is actually on to something? What if... What if... Okay. I got me some more water and onto this violet level. Me... I'm gonna try to get top 100. I don't. I'm not gonna promise I'm gonna get top 100 this game, but we will see. Especially since this game is running at lower frame rate, and as I know, it's a bad excuse. But it is actually running at lower frame rate. I, uh, that's why a lot of games. I just I had to stop buying games on my Switch once I got a decent laptop. Just because, like, I like that it's portable, but it just runs terribly. Like, Fall Guys. Oh, there's that. Fall Guys. Fall Guys runs so badly on the Switch. It's... Alright. Uh, having a time with this level. Like, Fall Guys on the Switch. It doesn't run well at all. The textures are off. Like, the textures are off. Everything. Just, everything about it is just terrible. I got lags. Cap to 30 frames. Jittery. It's just not a good port. So, I would not recommend it. I bought it on, on PC because I still had a fun time, but... Well, now I didn't buy it. I downloaded it. It's free now. I downloaded it on PC. It was a fun time. Well, guys, it's still a fun game. But, on the Switch, absolutely not. It's not worth playing it portably for it to run so fairly. Right. Thought you could hold the space bar. Alright, that's not easy. I feel like it's so easy just to get half a second faster, but in practice it's not at all. Oh, I also have a new game, Enjoy Typing. It's like a horror game, but kind of meta horror game. It looked fun, I watched a review of it. I might play that. 
this involves like face tracking and stuff. It's kind of interesting. I have to have face cam on the phone for that, but still be fun. Be fun. Alright, I think I'm waiting too long now to use elevate. So I have to wait, but just just enough time. Alright, I'm gonna do like five more runs and then I can that. Hopefully I can actually Yeah, that's part of the song. That's part of the song. Hopefully I can actually beat this down level. That was the on white. a good time it was fun even though i was kind of uh even though i'm kind of bad at this game i had a good time hope you had a good time as well and uh, i guess the next stream is gonna be just cool location vr um keep out keep an eye out for that uh, we'll be talking about that on instagram twitter uh youtube pretty much any social media i will be talking about it forever because we finally reached our goal so thank you for that and i will see you cannot seem to play the game correctly. Right, I'm gonna do like five more runs and then I can Alright. What the <sighs> I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. It's not going very well. I'm not gonna count that as an attempt because I didn't even do it. Don't hit the press up hit box. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna stick them out the yeah.
was the on white thank you thank you people for coming out to the stream i had a good time it was fun even though i was kind of uh even though i'm kind of bad at this game i had a good time hope you had a good time as well and uh, i guess the next stream is going to be just the location vr um keep out keep an eye out for that i will be talking about that on instagram twitter uh youtube pretty much any social media i will be talking about it forever because we finally reached our goal so thank you for that and i will see you